unfortunate incident. Staying with the same story, Transport uh, CS Kipchumba Morkomen has issued new directives after the Londiani Road accident. This after he visited the accident scene in Londiani where a trailer was involved in a tragic road accident. In a statement released on Saturday, Morkomen said the trailer involved in the accident with registration number RAC164W slash RL. 2379 was registered in Rwanda. The CS added that all the victims of the accident were either trading on the roadside market or waiting to board public service vehicles at the roadside car park. In new directives issued by the Ministry of Transport, the CS called for all markets along the road reserve to be relocated and tasked the Kenya National Highways Authority to construct access roads to the markets. Morkomen also called on relevant agencies to revise speed limits in the area and provide bumps and signage. He directed the National Tra Safety and Transport Authority, NTSA, to include the dangerous section as a black spot and install speed detection cameras in the upcoming pilot phase. Now, the retesting of public service vehicles and commercial service vehicle drivers should continue as a way of assessing drivers' competency before the renewal of their driving licenses. The CS said the ministry, in consultation with various stakeholders, will finalize the development of the NTSA operation of commercial service vehicles regulations. Murkomen said that the Ministry of Transport will hold consultative meetings with the East African community to guide on the harmonization of motor vehicle inspection in the region. In addition, he said all county transport safety committees should re-embark on road safety education and awareness programs for traders. In the new directives, uh, the CS also said there would be intensified anti-drunk driving operations across the country by the NTSA and the National Police Service. He also called on EPRA to investigate the sale of unadulterated fuel 